Nunca sol. She is our weaver. Fria con compitulation. Her ojos del mar turn from empty huevos. Expansive. Unborn eggshells. I live in a housing development. An HOA requires green grass in a drought state. At the entrance, an old wagon wheel from Anna, the daughter of the farm owner who once cultivated this land. Cultivate is to till as we cultivate. Dirt becomes dust and is no longer soil. As we cultivate, we remove from our nature. I walk six minutes to think about the water and how many times the sink runs over, how many times the shower takes longer than it ever did in California, because the high desert does not talk about our lack of water. Recursos, a lack thereof is what curses us. The mentality of lack and lack of mentality is our curses. What do we consider resources in land without water, in land we've covered with fake grass? Green, I read, is both the color of hope and Venus and the color of mold. Every day I walk six minutes to see the eagles outside the Walmart parking lot. Some days we are a pair other days, a menage a trois. I do not know if they are mother and child or a couple, but for a moment we become three and the parking lot behind me turns to grasses. The eagles oversee the temple of capitalism where the snake goddess can be purchased for $35.99 by mail only, complete with a Maria Gambutas explanation of her snakes and coloration. The small goddess from Crete unearthed in our living rooms for $35.99. I cross the street to our temple. El templo es our template for disparity. The HOA does not shop at Walmart. Walmart patrons cannot afford to maintain our costly lawns. No one talks about the water. No one looks at the water bills as we sign up for automatic payments. There's a sign taped to the telephone pole, lost cloud, last seen in the sky, looks white 
fluffy, name Mr. Cotton, moves fast, doesn't always drift to his name. If found, send bird to my house. Asterix. He scares easily. Below it, a second sign, taped over in plastic. Found! Exclamation point. A cloud. A piece of cotton taped to him. By bird, he doesn't seem too scared. Knows his name, Mr. Cotton. No one thinks about the grass greening, browning in late summer, and what grasses may have grown had Anna's father not settled on the farm. El Césped es un paradiso in our heads. La Aguila es nos regreso a la agua. The eagle is our return to the water. The water is us. La Aguila es nosotros.